Hey guys, welcome back to my Patreon reaction series to Zoid's Genesis. We're up to episode 14. Um, last episode, we've seen just how awful Die Guard is. Um, they've uh, ransacked the city. They're obviously searching for something. Um, looks like it may be to do with the Zoid, as I like to call it, the Zoid oil. Um, but I feel like there's something else that they're looking for. Uh, Ruji is um, getting really upset with what he's seeing, obviously, so am I, um, because they're separating children and their parents, and it's just not good. So let's see what happens this episode in three, two, one. Hmm. I am going to skip the OP this time because I haven't got much else to say and I want to get into this, so skipping. All right, let's do this. He can get very fast, and he's just going to destroy them, yeah. Poor guys. And he can just shoot the horns off and... <laughs> just bring them back out and destroy them. Yeah, they were retreating too. So, Ruji, I know you're going, you're going to try and do something about this. I can tell. Escape. Yeah, we need to get out of here. Yeah, they're already worn out. This is understandable. Again, as I said, this guy could, could be going under a different name now. And if Ruji's really has found this guy already, he won't know. Yeah, Ruji's definitely going to fight. Mm. What does it say this time? I did. What are you guys going to do, though? You're just waiting for the... I know you're waiting for, you know, someone to communicate. To see if they, you can find this one guy. But... He's going to be shot at this rate. Yeah, 
we're not going to see this guy again. Damn. <laughs> yep. Meanwhile, with the other two. They're stuck. They can't even. <laughs> yeah, starting to realize this is probably not a good idea anymore. It's yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what do you you two guys need to start doing something more? Like, I'm getting frustrated. That's all I'm doing. I'm getting frustrated with this. Yeah, he's figured it out. It's obvious. I really bet this is the guy they're looking for. Mm-hmm. Of course you don't plan on telling them. Yeah, this, it's got to be this guy. Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry, it wasn't this guy. No, he's not here. Richard Merrick, what's that? Right, you got a lead at the very least. But, hmm, where is... Yeah, that's not going to stop him. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's the them in a nutshell. So let's see what he this guy has to say. Yeah, I didn't think he was going.
Oh. Headquarters, yeah. Yeah. Do you know... Hmm. Yeah, they're on patrol. They have to be very quiet. And that guy was listening in as well. Alright. Uh. Yeah, shit. Oh, shit. Defense guard. Okay. Okay, so they know about all the secret hidden away tunnels that they can use that Delagard doesn't know about. Okay, that could work. Okay. Maybe, if he's still alive. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, there's a plan this time, luckily. Yeah, try and get him out from, you know, a very heavy fired fortress. Hopefully this plan works because... Oh, yeah, this is your fault, Ruji. <laughs> yeah. Ruji was trying to help, but it didn't work. Yeah, the basics of operating a biozoid. Oh, wait. She's not there. Hmm. So, yeah, I'm assuming she's dead. I'm pretty sure that was the lady's mother. That uh, boy's mother, too. Oof. Yeah. 
Yeah. And Rooney. Okay, yep, yeah, this is why you needed, probably should have acted sooner, unfortunately, but. Mm, there's nothing else you can really do. As long as they take down some of these idiots, these bastards, I should say. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, damn. No, you didn't. He got out. <laughs> yeah, time to move. <laughs> yep. Shouldn't you go do something too? Yes, you should. <laughs> Scored back up. Try and save as many people as possible, maybe. <laughs> like, seeing them run is great. How did they get up there? Okay, then just walk into it? Okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Oof. Yeah. Is he has he passed away or something? He was an old man. Yeah, he was frail. Hmm. <laughs> Hopefully the others show up soon so they can deal with this, this guy. You can find somebody else. Hmm. Oh. Oh, okay.
This is what they are like. You have to realize this is what a war is. This is what really reality is. Damn. And censor. Is that censor or was it after thought? Yeah, Rakan's here. Mm. Now, this is what I'm talking about, like a major war, casualties on both sides. Ruji is going to learn a valuable lesson from this. And the city burns. Yeah. Is Ruji. Yep, yeah, he's a child after all. He is a child. He the, the only thing that's happened to his village is, you know, the generator being destroyed. Now he's seen that, you know, people die. Like civilians do get killed. And he's back at square one again. They, he has no one to find, you know, he can't find someone to uh, fix the generator. I'm sure there's somebody else he can find though, but yeah, this, he's been putting all his hopes on into this one, one guy. And I've been saying the last couple of episodes, like that was 10 years ago. It's possible that he's, you know, moved on or dead by now. And they were just barely too late. If they had like got found out about the that he was moved to headquarters earlier, like a couple of days beforehand, they could have uh, spoken to him. But chances are he may have still passed away. All right, and that's the preview. Damn, that... Okay, that was probably the darkest couple of episodes I've seen so far in this show. Seriously, the darkest I've seen. Um, but it was still really good. Uh, this is definitely a learning curve for Ruji, I think. This is going to make him shift gears a bit, and he's definitely going to be... Maybe he'll be one of those characters where he wants to destroy every single Dalagard... Uh, Zoid and person that he comes across from now on, but we'll see what happens in the next episode. So, yeah, I think not only actually, it's not just Ruji that's learned some stuff this episode. It was also um, Katana and um, and Seji as well. Like the ability of like not being able to do anything, not be able to re to act or anything like that, and just stare in horror at everything around you is like. That will be num uh mind numbering uh numbing sorry mind numbingly uh painful uh yeah I would never want to be in that sort of situation so let me know your thoughts of this episode in the comment section below guys I'll per usual and uh you can find a link to my latest video here link to my YouTube channel here um you can find links to my anime list to my Twitter and all that in the description below if you feel like checking those out and I will see you in the next one guys have a good day as always bye.